What's happening guys, Ardo HD here with a new FIFA 13 on my team video. Today guys, it's a new episode in the series, A Poor Man's View. Today the episode's on David Silva guys, I know that I'm doing quite a lot of Barkers playing Lee Plus at the moment, but I'm thinking this is probably the best, because the, the probably the most popular team on FIFA 13 I would say is the Barkers Premier League. So today I've gone for David Silva, he is a uh, set up Matilda, plays for Man City in the Barkers Premier League. See the card on your screen's been changed to set Matilda, I was just getting the picture for the template guys. And uh, you can see, guys, in real life, he's a monster. On this game, he's a beast as well. He's a real top quality player. He's 80 overall for a reason. Look at his price. On PSD, he's 58 to 62,000 coins. On Xbox, he's 50 to 54,000 coins. And on PC, he's 62 to 64,000 coins. So he is quite a pricey player. But there's a reason for that, guys. He is an absolute beast. His best attributes, I think, is his agility. He's really light on his feet, guys. He manages to change direction so quickly. His ball control, the ball is constantly glued to his feet. It's so hard to get the ball off David Silva and all my team, guys. A short passing and long passing is exceptional. He cuts defences apart. I mean, a lot of the time people feel as though they need to play a long chip through ball to cut a defence open. You can play a low pass along the ground and it will cut defences open, guys. It swerves left to right, cuts the defence open time and time again. He is a real good player. But I'll move on now and I'll show you who I bought as a cheap equivalent, I think is the closest you're going to get to David Silva. Right guys, so now we're on to the, the basically the cheap equivalent and you can see on your screen the guy I have chosen that I think basically is the closest, cheapest equivalent you will get to David Silva is Iago Falke. Silva is set at that midfielder who is Spanish who plays in the Barkers Premier League funnily enough so if you want to board the Spain team, Iago Falke is a cheap equivalent. If you want to board the BPL team, he's a cheap equivalent. You can see the prices on your screen now guys. He's 11 to 15,000 coins on PS3, he's 17 to 19,000 coins on Xbox, and funnily enough, he's only 2 to 4,000 coins on PC. That is mind boggling. This guy is an absolute monster, guys. He is a quality player, he's a 4 star skiller, same as David Silva. See, I picked up his best attributes, his ball control is 80, he's got 82 agility, he's a 4 star skiller, his skill moves are really good, guys, really smooth and precise. He's got 75 short passing and 71 passing. Again, guys, his passing is so good. I mean, you'll see it in the gameplay, I pick out quite a few of his passes, you know, I didn't want to just get goals with uh, Iago Falke in the clips, because, I mean, I think at set attack midfielder, yeah, you want to set attack midfielder to score goals, but predominantly, you want him to make chances for your strikers on this game, and Iago Falke certainly does that. He's an absolute beast, guys. But I've done talking about him, we'll go into the clips, I'll talk you through some of the goals, some of the passes I played to him, and I'll talk about him a little bit more. Right, guys, so now into the gameplay, you can see here, Iago Falke, just fake shots, Look at that ball, that's a defence splitting pass straight through it. Hasselbank should do better with the finish, but here again, lovely chip the ball over the top and he gets on the end of that, that's so unlucky. That could end ended up in the bottom corner. Here again, he's facing the wrong way, you know, he's facing towards his own goal, he still manages to wrap his foot around it, get that ball out wide, great ball whipped in and a bull ahead in the back of the net. Here, he gets inside, beats two men, he chips the keeper and it auto switches and my guy runs it into the net. That was so gutting for me. Here a nice little reverse pass through the channel and the keeper pulls off a great save from Daly. What about this? A scoop turn, bullets that into the side net and a great finish from Jago Falke. I didn't say that his finishing was one of his pure standout attributes but I did think that he had a decent shot on him. You know, decent enough for the set of midfielder anyway. Here, lovely bit of skill, again, right through the heart of the defence, Daly's in on goal and he finesses that around the keeper. More and more you'll see guys, he, he's passing is phenomenal, you know, he's not slow either, he's got roughly, I think it's about 80 pace, something like that, or it's in the high 70s, but there, it's a nice one too, and a great volley into the back of the net. That pretty much sums up the gameplay guys, you know, I mean, definitely, if you can't afford David Silva, definitely go out there and buy Iago Falke. I hope you've enjoyed this episode guys. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe to the channel and uh, follow me on Twitter. Adios guys.